What do you drive, man? Pull up to the scene with my ceiling missing. Unboxing with Tegan. I was gonna call you Jeremy. Don't ever call me. <laughs> so we got a whole whole collection of OEM Mazda parts here from one of our uh, sources. One of the, new one of the hook -ups. control arms. Nice clean aluminum. That's hot. That's really hot. Very single door seal. Any kind of weather stripping imaginable. to the bottom of the splitter okay. and uh, load it up with resin in between some poly sheets and then we'll have, uh, we'll leave the first layer of poly against the table and uh, rip off the top on that one, put a second layer down, take out the air, then we'll throw the core on top, two more layers of carbon, uh, roll the bubbles out and uh, then we're just going to bag that right to the table and we're not going to go too crazy, maybe 10 inches and uh, just to make sure we have a tight bond. Mm -hmm. The four foot hole will give us 10 feet and just fine. Actually, how wide is it splitting? I'm going to start with that. Throw the camera on your bed head. That's a good sleep right there. <laughs> You want some help? Okay. Like, yeah. just ask and... Yeah, boy! Do it your way a bit. Well, you just come to my edge of the table. Right there. So we can cut the fabric on that. We can use the top piece there for the side skirts. Uh, might even be able to make canards out of this yet. Uh, 4x8 sheet of carbon fiber, uh, all said and done with the gel coat on it, it's about 500 bucks. So we got four pieces of 4x8, just the fabric itself. So it's a $2,000 splitter? Essentially it will be, yes. Just the material, never mind labor. This core is like 800 bucks. Why the fuck is this on my head? Just grab my wallet. to the floor, As I key off, and then keep your foot on the floor and then key back on. Okay. Back up. Yeah, Jeremy it's says, recording. I don't, dude, I don't know how to it's do this. It's recording. Just hold, point just point it there. It's recording? Yeah, yeah. Okay.
off the horn. Yeah, it's going off without me touching anything. Is that like your rev limiter oh, though? Oh, could it be? Yeah. It is? Yeah. Wow, I didn't know that. Quite an angle there. I need to get the right pulley on that alternator. We're just we did not change anything on the alternator. <laughs> Car's future is giving up all of its cluster clips and fasteners for another car. But for now, we're going to see if we can take this apart without actually breaking it. Full? Yeah. Oh, wow. Jeremy never opened it. He took it to my car. We're going to take some more screws off first. See if we can get a little bit more flex. Everything is solid on this one. This is very strange. One of the gauge hood uh, screws actually fits underneath this middle panel, so that makes it a little bit tricky. Okay, I got four minutes left on this SD card. We gotta make this happen. I gotta stay. Man, yeah, I wanna get on with it. Gotta get the what you get in the car. 